just in Canal then and we are stopping for some ice cream. How's your ice cream? <laughs> and we just stopped over because we had a conference and things and um, we're glad to be leaving. We're excited to go to Coral Bay and do some snorkeling. Woo! <laughs> hey, Julian. Be done. <laughs> just north of um, Carnarvon, there are blow holes which we've come to see before we go snorkeling. We're going snorkeling for the first time on the trip. So last night we arrived at um, this campsite in the dark and it was very hard to find a spot. So we squeezed in and we were not very welcome. So we're planning to move over there. And we've waited a few hours for them to pack up their caravan so we can haul out swags and tents across. This is five fingers is out there. Let's go snorkeling! <laughs> Heading out snorkeling in um, the main Coral Bay, and we asked about seeing a dugong, but apparently they're only in the seaweed, which is quite far out. So turtles would be good. What do you want to see? We're doing a sexy snorkel today. Oh yes, no rashy today. We are well, snorkeling a bit earlier. Hello, David Attenborough. Hello. <laughs> Welcome. This way we have the good the seaweed. <laughs> Natural habitat. <laughs> so yesterday we finished up with snorkeling and we um, had nice fish and chips for dinner. Yummy. <laughs> we stayed at this lovely luxury stopover. Oh, look at that. And it's just a rest stop that anyone can stop at. But it has toilets, so that's pretty good. And we are about to head off. We're heading off to Valara Station Woo! where they promised damper and warm scones, uh -huh. tea, coffee, showers. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs>
whale shark tour today and we're on the boat ready to go. We're going with Ningaloo whale sharks and we just had an hour bus ride to get out here. Not an hour, maybe that's We've got our stinger suits ready. So first up today we're doing the Mandu Mandu Gorge Walk. Even though it says allow for two hours, we've learned that if you divide that by about four, it's a bit more accurate, so maybe half an hour, quick one. Pretty windy last night, we had the windiest night I think of the trip where all our tents were just like flapping and the swags are flapping and the ground was too hard to peg everything down properly so everyone's pegs are coming out. I woke up in the night and heard Julia hammering away trying to desperately to tie down her tent. But I think we slept enough and ready to go. We're just changing our Ugg boots for our real shoes for this small hike. I was like, oh, no, like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> Exciting! Uh -huh. 